Cairo. One of them, Al Ghuri, and another one, Al uh, Bazara. This is for Muhammad Bazara. His name is Allah. So Al Ghuri, it is Sultan Al Ghuri. The time. It's like a uh, hotel. Uh, yes. Second and third floor. This means shops. And second and third floor, the place for the people to sleeping. Mm -hmm. Door 1504 to 1505. So all this place one year to build one, it. To build it. From so here is the corridor inside the Wikala. Corridor, of course, uh, you know, it's not lighted and maybe just a point of light. Every unit has its access door, and the corridor continues inside to give access to every unit. Once you are in the unit, you see one height here. So, this is one height, and there's a stair going upstairs, and then you have the double height of the uh, unit with all light and higher ceiling extend on two floors and uh, you look down you have the mushrabiya you have the the two other floor and the whole wikala from here so we can go uh, so this is a room so we're gonna go upstairs second level Shukran. so inside there this is uh, you know uh, Le Corbusier, uh, Unité de Marseille, uh, before 600 before he was born. So this is the double height. This is the second floor. We have some room here. We're getting windows and and people living in here. And then there is the third level. And then the main court where the light come up again, another third floor with a good height with the mushrabiya where people can sit and look underneath without being seen because of the privacy and this is the unit that is repeated in every unit of Wakalit El Ghuri This is another unit of Wakalit El Ghuri and the same, the same, the same, uh, conce même concept. So uh, the, uh, the same shows here. We guard the patio with the fountain and then all the units. And then the double hauteur of the salle de choses jour. And we take the escaliers encore une fois. It's the same design. Okay, and then we're gonna go to the third level. Where we stay with the Muslim oh. video. C'est différent. Wow, more space here, I think. Yeah, what's amazing is all these were hand carved. I'm telling you. There's all the carving marks. Yeah, the, uh, all of origin, yeah. origin yeah. stones. That's a lot of stones. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Serious business. Very tight, very narrow streets, 
that has all the time shade and shadow, so sun doesn't go in here. And the circulate in this street like a suction to the hot area, right? Yeah. So this is hot, so the, the air is going yeah. this way from the uh, shaded area to the sunny yeah. area. That's why when you stand here, you have a breeze. And this is the design that we respected in yeah. all, all cities to uh, get out of the hot areas. Yeah. Yeah, this is natural, you see. good oh yeah unfortunately not many tourists uh, come here and it's a uh, hidden this is treasures hidden for me oh, yeah. I mean I think that's why I'm excited to do what I'm doing well, it's amazing how much of this stuff has stayed and not been torn down and modern stuff replaced it it's yeah that's it that'd be a shame if that ever happened yeah. no every little piece it's uh it's a uh, it's in the program. I mean, she's going to tell you what is this, what is this, yeah. what they do here, and she's going to yeah. explain everything on, in here like that. Façade même, ils, sont, ils, ont, ils ont eu euh, le concept d'avoir beaucoup de cantilever ou euh, cavoli ou bien porte-feu pour euh, créer de l'ombre encore euh, pendant la, le soleil pour, pour euh, éviter d'avoir tout le mur euh, exposé au soleil. Ça, ça coupe la, la température et euh, le concept de fontaine avec de l'eau et puis l'air euh, qui vient de l'entrée c'est pour donner de rafraîch... rafraîchissement de l'air. Si, si je m'assis ici ou, ou juste je me mets là, je n'ai pas du tout la même, le même courant d'air comparant que je reste ici. Parce que si ça vient, l'air, ça vient de, de, des, rues, des rues étroites et puis il vient ici. So here we see all the cantilevers that create shade and shadow. To, uh, to cover the walls and uh, to avoid having the whole wall on the, exposed to the sun so they cut the temperature and all opening air coming through the Mushrabiya and the current, I mean the fresh air is coming uh, through the entry to the patio and it's completely different feeling when you stand here in comparison with when you stand here. This is the entry from the tight street, the narrow street. It's, it's beautiful, uh, current air, fresh. And when you come here, you enjoy the patio.
But according to UNESCO, this is the largest E1 in the whole Islamic world and the whole, all the Islamic uh, construction in the whole world at Sultan Hassan. Vous allez écouter le, le monsieur là qui va chanter des euh, chansons spirituelles. Que pour nous, bien. Oui. Tu as bien organisé la, la truque. <rire> La ilaha illallah Alayya nahya Wa alayha namut Wa alayha Wa biha Nubathu insha Santa Sheikh Saeed.